Hey Clean Fiction Dripper folks, what's up? Today we're gonna to be doing part two of my two-part series of cleaning bathroom hacks. But before we get started, if you're new to our channel, subscribe to Clean Freaking Germaphobe and hit the notification bell. Okay, let's get started. Let's start with the shower. If you use a squeegee after your shower, it helps to keep down the watermark buildup on your shower. But if you already have some water spots, use a dry magic eraser to easily and magically wipe away those watermarks. Thanks, Mr. Clean. While we're talking about showers, after you dry off, use your towel to dry off the handle and the shower head. That keeps water stains from building up and keeping your faucet and your handles shining daily. When your shower needs a good cleaning, get a scrub brush like this. Mix half vinegar and half liquid Dawn into the compartment for a powerful yet safe cleaning agent that is great for hard water and soap scum. Love using old toothbrushes for cleaning, but hate how they don't get into the corners? Take an old toothbrush and boil the head and the neck of the toothbrush for 10 minutes. Then use pliers to bend the neck to a 90 degree angle. And now you have a compact brush that is perfect for corners and tight spaces. If you have hard water buildup on your shower head, try soaking your shower head in vinegar overnight. This helps to break up the hard water that might be clogging your jets. Afterwards, use an old toothbrush to help descale the faucet head to help improve water pressure and flow. Keep a box of baking soda in the bathroom. Once a week, sprinkle some baking soda into the toilet, let it sit for 20 minutes, and then flush. This helps to keep the toilet clean longer and helps to keep the gross toilet smells away. Cover a small screwdriver with a Clorox wipe. Use it to get into the cracks of the toilet seat in the water tank. You'll be surprised how much grossness gets stuck in there. Trouble with your toddler wasting toilet paper for their entertainment? Fold the leftover cardboard toilet paper roll in on itself and put it inside the new toilet paper roll. This will make it more difficult to unroll the toilet paper, discouraging extra waste. So let's talk about cleaning your toilet plunger. That's right, if you think about it, that plunger manages to get itself into quite a few messes. It too needs a cleaning from time to time. Put the plunger in the toilet and flush a few times. Then add one half cup of bleach to the toilet bowl and let the plunger soak for an hour. Then flush again, and there you go. An easy clean, and the best part is, you don't have to touch the dirty part. Sometimes we forget to clean our cleaning equipment, and one of our germiest cleaning utensils is our toilet brush and its holder. It's often overlooked, sometimes never being cleaned at all, ever. Worse, most people put the toilet brush back in the toilet brush holder when it's still wet, leaving your toilet brush to harbor even more germs. Every time you are done cleaning your toilet bowl, then let the toilet brush dry while propped in between the toilet bowl and seat. Spray the toilet brush holder as well. Replace the brush into its holder when both are completely dry. That's it for now. Subscribe for more videos like this one. Hey, you're still watching. That's awesome. You know what? If you liked this video, I bet you would really, really like my video on the 10 amazing products to speed up your cleaning routine. Cause who doesn't want their cleaning routine to go faster? Unless you're like one of those Cinderella types who likes to sit on the floor and mop and sing and clean all day. Seriously, I mean, unless you're one of those Cinderella types whose favorite thing to do is clean and sing. And even if you're that kind of a person, I still think that you would love this video. But first, hit the subscribe button right there. That button right there. It's okay, I'll wait. Go ahead and hit it. Good, okay, now go ahead and click the 10 must-have cleaning products and I'll see you over there. Bye.